The butterflies for Caleric and Justin. And then you say, I'm ready after I see that. Well, Seeger's looking ready right there. That's line drive base hit to left field for Corey Seeger. He's never seemed to have many problems facing lefties. Righting was hitting 333, a couple doubles and a home run. But he's punched out by Bob Guerin. I'm sure he'll have some words with his bench coach when he goes back out there behind the plate for the next inning. Caleric ahead of him, one and two, Jerry, and able to get Matt Beatty, but we saw a lot of left-handed batters go to the same fate against Adam Caleric last year. Nothing across for the visiting side in the top of the first. The home half coming up right after this. The starting pitching is concerned. Clayton Kershaw officially made the opening day starter again. Dave Roberts saying that yes, that he'll be on the actual opening day roster, if you will, when you're talking about those amount of guys. But Dave Roberts said he'll probably go about two innings tonight. Ball is hit well to left center, but it is caught just in front of the warning track. Thank you very much. A lot of Mookie Betts flying out to start this one. He's really found himself. That one's hit hard. Scorched. Nice play there by Matt Bates. There's a cute story about Jock Peterson and his home run because Cody Bellinger, these guys hear each other with no fans there. Cody Bellinger was playing center field, and as Jock came up in their close friendship, he yells, easy out, yeah. easy out. And then Jock goes deep, and he gave it back to Cody when he was rounding second. I know the players want that. Especially if Vasse is talking. <laughs> hey, hey no, you know, I love you, David. Justin Turner was the one that really wanted it and said, you know what, when they tried it with him, he loved it, and it gave him a lot of a general. Ryan in here is obviously trying to get established from two years back. Believe it or not, this is a big inning for him. This is a big opportunity for him. He needs to get back. He needs to get his confidence, get his feel back, get his arm strength back. He was getting hit in 19 compared to 18 when his ERA was below one. Edwin Rios. Wow. Absolutely crushing that one. I guess the batter's eye, not a problem for Edwin Rios right there, Jerry. We saw Edwin Rios hit a lot of tape measure shots last year in the minor leagues and even hit a couple at the big league level. John, I absolutely love this kid. This kid's swing reminds me of Victor Martinez. Remember that? Detroit Tigers catcher, Cleveland Indians DH. Very powerful young man. Tape measure shot. Probably needs to be in the dirt. Is that just a matter of it takes time, it takes reps to get to that point? Oh, and a unlucky bounce off the bag there. Otherwise, that's a routine ground out. Luke Rayleigh will take that single. Can't teach that. Yep. Well, we're going to see the real Blake Trina. There it is right there. Now he's 100% healthy. I expect big things out of Corey Seager. Browns one. That's going to find a hole. So Corey Seager is two for two. Good piece of hitting right there. Stayed back on that breaking ball. Didn't, didn't commit too soon. And really... Timed it perfectly. Saw a couple guys spitting and almost saying, oh my gosh, I, I just I just spit. So that's going to take a while for guys to get used to not doing that. And, and Major League Baseball has to understand. Jerry with his changeup, the deception. Absolutely. As long as he keeps that changeup down. He's got, he a Kevin, Cody Bellinger. he got a little Kevin Apier type uh, delivery Much there. better in the second half of the season. It's back-to-back -back walks by Marshall Kosowski here in the bottom of the seconds. Camp Dave Roberts not available to say, or not able to say, rather, why they are not here, but certainly still hopeful. Kike Hernandez lines one to right. Nice diving catch. And I think you could see it because he started missing the pitches he hit early on. He was missing the fastball late in the season. There he, he tatter, tatered a, a hanging breaking ball. Or what do you want to see out of Dylan Floro? Was a bit of a struggle at times for him. Not going the other way. He's got to be able to stay on that pitch. Ball's well, driven to left center. As you can hear everybody saying, I got it, I got it, Jerry. And uh, Jock Peterson did have it as he makes the catch for the out. And that's his room buddy right there, AB. Want to make sure he secured that out. Jock Peterson, a former center fielder. Pretty good left fielder now. Great show chain, all smiles. <laughs> Definitely has the bat to play in the big leagues. Mercy. Mm. Good pitch to hit right there, and it's lined into center field for a base hit. So Edwin Rios is having a good bat tonight. Back in 2018, so here he is back in the Dodgers organization. Pops one up. Big league pop-up right there. Kike Hernandez has it for the outs. All right, let's go to the bottom of the third now. Marshall Kosowski getting another inning of work.
I think with Kbert, you're going to want to get him at, at bats and develop him. Hey, See? I told you, John. He's a hit machine. There you go. I told you. That's good He's approach, due. too. Line drive, base hit the other way by Absolutely. Rocky Gale. Breaks up the no-hitter, guys. That way, Rocky. That a boy. There's a guy, uh, Joe, opposite <laughs> East, um, used to call some pitches a mile outside. <laughs> and Aston Barnes can't find it. <laughs> Too long. Too long. <laughs> the 3-2 pitch to Mookie. That's a base hit to left field, and Kosowski hung that one, and Mookie knew what to do with that. Got yeah, Chico Escuela in left field right there making the play. Well played. Well played by Chico in left. I think he went four innings, got his pitch count up. But I'll tell you what, Chico in left Chico's field. Chico's got to make this catch. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Calm the heart. Calm the heart. Throw him out. Oh, Throw him out. <laughs> Throw him out. You don't run on Chico. You don't run on Chico. <laughs> no. And, and I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this. A lot of times... And the players know scouting reports, right? Chico throws batting practice, you know, in the cage, and he's got a rocket of an arm. Mm -hmm. Outstanding, Chico. He might make this. He's going to want that video too. He might make this club. He's going to want that for the he's archives. Francisco, that's fun to say. Are they pulling him out of the game? They're calling the game. So the final is one to nothing. Well, that was fun. That's a perfect way to end it, actually, Jerry. You let Chico make the catch there in left field. And again, we're talking about scouting reports. The players know that Chico has a great arm. He